Oh, you're back. How's it looking over in Ferdiad? The reports are true. There's some odd-looking weaponry mounted throughout the city. As far as I can tell, though, the townspeople themselves remain unharmed. I'm pleased to say Lord Rodrigue and Sir Gustav have been confirmed safe as well. That's great! Where are they now? After working to free Duke Ivan, they escaped the castle alongside some of the captured knights. Armed with what scant weaponry they could find, they brought the fight down to the city itself. My old man never ceases to amaze. Shouldn't even be a surprise at this point. I should add, the Western Lord's armies aren't the only forces occupying the capital. There is another, one we can't identify at present. I doubt even the great Lord Roderick and Sir Gustav will be able to hold out much longer. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. We should focus on keeping them safe, right? Don't be too hasty. Why do you think the two of them are causing this uproar in the first place? To create a diversion, I know. But I don't think that means we should just abandon them either. I agree, Felix. I won't leave my father to die. Besides, I don't think His Majesty would want us saving him if it meant sacrificing two of his most loyal retainers. <sighs> Fine. We'll help them if we can. That better? All that said, we won't be able to save the king while the townspeople are still in danger. Sounds pretty straightforward then. We move on the castle and mop up in town as we go. Annie and I know these streets better than the back of our hands. We can guide you. Dudu must be somewhere in the castle too. We have to rescue him before it's too late. Our plan settled then. Everyone, move out! Come on, it's time to rescue our full king, and whoever else we find along the way. Here goes. Let's fight together. Begin the operation. Allow me to lend a hand. I'll do what I can. I'll back you up. Hear you loud and clear. I might just be able to help. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. The streets are flooded with enemy soldiers. But one wrong step, and we'll end up hurting the civilians instead. Be careful, everyone. We'll I'm start coming. by carving a path to the castle town. On me! Got this. Let's give it a shot. Allow me. We'll give it a thousand percent. Leave everything to me. Shall we? 
Let's give it a shot. Take a breather. Smartest move opening the gate for us. Let's crush them here and push on into town. the weapons we heard about. They look like some kind of fire form. <laughs> Who do you think you face? Rodriguez struggling. We have to help. I'll give it a thousand. 
thousand percent. Leave everything to me. Shall we? I'll provide assistance. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. I've got this. My turn. I must return to the castle. Huh? The new surrounded. We have to help him. You got my back? To victory! We'll do it together! I've got you now! And we'd better be quick about it by the look of things. We need to do something about that weapon, but I doubt attacking it head-on will do us any good. There must be controls we could use to shut it down. I could swear I've seen such a thing somewhere around here. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. What's this? I'm humble. You went out of your way to help me. It's a shame to admit my own weakness. Might as well deal with the other one, too. I wonder if those are the controls. Let's link up. To victory! We'll do it together! I got you now! I got this! worry about me. We must rescue His Majesty at once. But we are worried. You're our friend too, just like Dimitri. Not a problem. I've got this. Allow me! Phoenix! Why have you come for me? I appreciate your help. Right on me! Not your day, huh? Sit. I'm coming too! This is it! Not sure how to work this thing, but here goes nothing. The attacks have come to a stop. They should be safe now. Shall we? This stronghold will fall! Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Take a breather. Gotta do, uh, something. Come on, please work. Go! Now! Not gonna hold that! Not a problem. Move out! You should have hurried straight to His Majesty, Felix. Yet here you are. Thank you. We're getting overwhelmed. We weren't about to just watch you die. 
I was wondering when your merry little bands might show up. Yeah, for you. I've got a nice mouse grave ready in my room. Here goes. Let's fight together. Not a problem. I've got this. His Majesty is in the castle. We must press on. Change this moment. Their assault has ceased. That should give us an easier time moving around now. Gotcha. Thanks for that. And sorry for the trouble. I'll give it a thousand percent. Leave everything to me. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. I've got this. My turn. Please be safe, Your Majesty. Not a problem. I've got this. Not a problem. I've got this. I'll give it a thousand percent. Leave everything to me. Let's give it a shot. Allow me. Right on me! Not your day, huh? I'm coming too! This is it! Shall we? Let's give it a shot! I can only hold out a little longer. Father, please stay strong. We're coming. Please retreat. I'll give it a thousand percent. Leave everything to me. Here goes. Let's fight together. <laughs> How did you? You saved my life. I can still fight. We need to move fast. Attack! I'm glad you're safe. Now come on, let's kick some enemy behind, you and me. You wide open! 
shall we? Let's give it a shot. Not a problem. I've got this. It's the net time. You're tougher than you think. Here goes. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I am grateful, but there is no time to dawdle. We must make to rescue the king at once. Don't worry, I'm sure we'll make it in time. Not much further. You are too calm. Leave everything to me. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. I can still fight! You pay attention! Leave everything to me. My turn. I can help. Arid far belongs in his majesty's hands. We must reclaim it. Don't let them live with your lives. Don't let them have it. it makes me sick seeing that thing with the enemy. We'll wrest it out of their cold, lifeless fingers. Not a problem. I've got this. I can go. Let's start the attack. Are you ready? Watch yourself. Please retreat. This lance is a symbol of the kingdom, and it's all the boar has left of his father. Let's bring it back where it belongs. It's the net time. Indeed. Take a breather. To his majesty. Shall we? Come with me, everyone. I'll give it a thousand percent. Time to push on. Dimitri, you okay? My friends, why have you come? As if we would just leave you here to die. Time to get you out. <clears throat> I'm afraid that I must stay. <clears throat> you saw what's happening out there. Should I try to leave, my people's lives are forfeit. <laughs> so they bind the boar not with chains, but with his utterly unreasonable sense of duty. They're gonna kill you in here, Dimitri. So be it then. If my death will keep my people safe, I won't allow it. <sighs> Dudu. Take it, Your Majesty. I. 
Whether it's duty towards the living or the guilt for all those we have lost, such burdens are not yours to bear by yourself. We are here to fight by your side, Your Majesty, and so we shall, now and always. Find them! This way! Typical boar. Can't help himself. <laughs> Do try to keep up. Back at ya. Strive to perform to the best of our ability. I've awaited this moment. On me! Any who stand in our way will taste the pointed end of my lance. Sneaking out of our room, You know what this means. We cannot allow even a single civilian casualty. Please, lend me your blade. Like I'd do anything else. Shall we? I'll provide assistance. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. I'll give it a thousand percent! Perform to the best of our ability. I've awaited this moment. All these ranged attacks are really cramping my style. We should find the controls and put an end to them once and for all. No! Please spare me! For you! What a None of this would be happening if your dear king had just All been right. a good little boy and done as he was told. That drawback would serve to be our quickest move forward. But the controls have been terrible. No surprise there. I'd be more shocked if they'd left them intact. Engineers, repair the controls and lower the drawbridge. Then do what you must to keep it safe. I'm counting on you. I see you came prepared, Phoenix. Let me your strength. Let's get it over with. Come on! Yes, understood. We will proceed as... Where are the knights when you need them? We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Shall 
shall we? Let's give it a shot. I've got this. My turn. I'll protect you. Someone help me! Please! I'm begging you! Got my back? To victory! We'll do it together! I got you now! Not a problem. I'm here to help. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Leave everything to me. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. I shall take the lead. I pray we've not arrived too late. Come, let us show them the might of House Gautier. At them, it must be the Margrave. Finally, some welcome news amidst this chaos. We'll go together. Let's get it over with. Yes, understood. <laughs> Stand down! Shall we? I'll provide assistance. We will proceed as planned. Someone! Anyone help! Oh no! We have to save them! We will... I think that did it. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Leave everything to me. Just watch. Let's team up. Go now. Not gonna hold back. Leave everything to me. Let's give it a shot. Allow me. I won't back down. Yes, this should help. Thanks. You don't want to die. We need to move fast. Maybe this. Thanks. Are you ready? Sorry. Please retreat. Yeah, right.
have hoped to accomplish that alone. Oh, I've been waiting for this. Let's have a little fun, shall we? I appreciate your help. Right on me! Not your day, huh? I'm coming too! Proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. I've got this. Take a breather. young flames rush to be snuffed out before their time. You must admit I went too easy on you. Perhaps I should have torn your eyes out and bound you in chains instead. We all have our regrets in life, Cornelia. And soon you'll regret ever being born. Strive to perform to the best of our ability. I've awaited this moment. No mercy. Let us crush and avenge. That should be all of them. Nice work. Let's get it over. Get lost. Yes, understood. Yeah. Stand down! Is this all you're capable of? Frankly, I'm getting a little bored here. Talk all you want, witch. It won't spare you your fate. Just watch. Give me a hand. 
Go! Now! Yeah. Not gonna hold them! I can go. Take a breather. I'll take you all on. How do you stand? Clever little insects. Try as you might to stamp them out. She'll take the lead. Oh, this falling back. <laughs> Go! Now! Not gonna hold you back! You don't this is it! She's on the verge of exhaustion. Let's finish this. Stop struggling and accept your fate, witch. Oh my, how simply terrifying. <sighs> do you really think you can afford to kill me? If you do, the truth about the tragedy of Dusker will evaporate into the shadows forever. I have no intention of slaying you. Not yet. But if you have something to say, I suggest you spit it out before I change my mind. Now, Cornelia. Earlier you said my father was betrayed, murdered by lords from within Fargus. But it was you who fueled the flame of that betrayal. You saw my uncle and Lord Arendelle join hands, and you brought the Western Lords and the Imperial Nobles together. All of it was you. <laughs> what a fascinating theory. There are two things I need to know. First, your motivation. Who are you working for, and why? I know what spurred my uncle and the Western Lords to act. While the Empire has long smoldered, waiting for even the slightest spark to reignite their fury. There are a thousand reasons why one might want to assassinate a king. But what's yours for this attempt on my life? And what of my father? Why murder him in a manner as roundabout as a staged raid? All you had to do was fail to end the plague 20 years ago, and the entire royal family would have been consumed by it. You have a point, but I couldn't say. In a sense, that was another lifetime completely. One more question, then. My stepmother's body was never recovered from the site of the tragedy. What happened to her? Tell me, Cornelia! You'll find the answers you seek in the Imperial capital, though you'll have to extract them from your dearest stepsister. She must surely know something, wouldn't you think? After all, she is your stepmother's actual flesh and blood. In Enbar? Now, I've really enjoyed our little chat here, but I have so many places to be. <sighs> Why, you? Don't be so sad. You'll be seeing me again before you even know it. Hesitate no longer. I need to be stronger, faster. I cannot grow complacent. Best to keep your expectations low. I'm just getting started. Hey, I'm stronger! <laughs> I 
think I've learned something new. This should come in handy. My apologies. Cornelia would not have escaped were it not for my carelessness. She's likely fled west in search of refuge with Viscount Mateus. As such, I will march west at once. I will not allow the western territories to go unpunished for this. Stop. Just stop. Felix? I've got something to say, Bor. And this time, you're going to listen. Time and time again, we've tried to get it through your thick skull. We might be your subjects, but we're your allies first. Yet you still insist on doing every little thing all by yourself. So what is it? Do you lack the ears to hear with? Or do you hear our words and just choose to ignore them? Felix, that's enough. I know how you feel, but you need to contain yourself. I can't. Two whole years I've bitten my tongue. The fool needs to hear this in the plainest terms possible. It was I who chose war with the Empire. I who murdered my uncle in cold blood. I who oppressed the Western Lords. I failed to save the people of Dusker. Failed to save Glen. And my father. The lives my actions stole from them are mine to atone for. Which I will do by exacting revenge on all who were involved. And by seeing my people safe. As for that burden, yes, I believe it is mine to bear alone. You truly are a solid gold fool. One could search the kingdom high and low and not find another as utterly asinine as you. And the rest of you, don't just stand there, speak up. Well, I know Felix has a strange way of showing it at times. But this is all because he worries about you, Dimitri. And it's not just him either. We all do. Your Majesty, you know my feelings on this matter. Six years ago, I too watched as nearly everything I cared about was taken from me. And Felix is no different. He lost his brother that day. This pain is not yours to shoulder alone. He's right, Your Majesty. That is why it is so frustrating to see you act like this. I can't say it's too surprising, though. You've always kept everything to yourself, even when you were a little kid. But what you're going through now, it's more than one person could possibly manage on their own. Please, Your Majesty. We just want to help. You can trust us. Like I said before, all you need to do is ask and I'll be at the ready. Besides, we'll all be out of work if you go this alone. We will assist you in whatever we must. Even vengeance. Thank you. All of you. Lady Cornelia, what's happened to you? Oh, I was too careless. I can hardly remember the last time I was this badly hurt. As for the capital, Viscount Mateus, we failed, and I doubt the king will soon forget our attempt to seize it. What? But how? Viscount, your son, the one who married a distant relative of House Gautier. 
They'll have his head. Same goes for the kin of all the other Western Lords. No. This king is a fool to be sure, but he's not foolish enough or kind enough to forgive those who serve his betrayers. I guarantee you that. His army will begin their march to subdue Western Fargus any moment now. If you don't want your territory stolen from you or your life, then your only choice is to rise in revolt. Yes. Yes, I understand. We will mobilize at once. <laughs>